Hey guys, it's Mia. Welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new here. I'm Mia. I post gymnastics and lifestyle content and you should subscribe. <laughs> hey guys, welcome back. So in today's video, I am going to be doing a back to school shopping haul. If you guys are new to my channel and you are not familiar with me, I'm going to boarding school this year. So a lot of these things aren't things you would necessarily think of for back to school. But for me, since I'm going to be living in my school, these are the sort of things that I need. <laughs> In this video I am doing a combined birthday haul as well because all of the things I got for my birthday are coming with me so I thought I would just chuck those in this video. So we've bought these over a couple of different shopping trips, it wasn't this big of a task I promise you guys. So without further ado, let's begin. It really stresses me out when... <laughs> So the first section that I'm going to start off with is school supplies because I feel like that's kind of what you guys clicked on the video for. So first of all I got a clear pencil case. This was from Ryman Stationery Shop. I really wanted to get a clear one because for exams it meant I didn't have to buy another one. So I got that. And then I got the essentials pen and pencils. So I got a pack of just like normal stolen pencils and I got a pack of black biro thick pens because these are the best pens for me personally. I got both of these from Wilco's I think. And then I got a Wilco's stationery set so this has a ruler, a protractor and two triangles just a geometry set and then I got a Pritt stick glue stick. They did have like non-branded ones but Pritt sticks are definitely the best and this one is recyclable so it's good for the environment. <laughs> And then, I'm not really sure if this counts as stationery or not, but I put it in. So I got some sticky tack for my room because I have like pin boards and stuff. And I thought for my Polaroids, I can put them up on the wall using blue tack. I got a pack of four slim highlighters. These are pastel from Wilco's. I get these every single year and they're amazing because they're so small. They fit into your pencil case really, really well. And then I got these two... Handy dandy items, I got a hole puncher and a stapler. These actually, I didn't colour coordinate them, but they ended up being colour coordinated somehow anyways. So I got those. And then something else that magically colour coordinated with them as well was this A4 project book. So this is one of the books that has different sections so I can use it for different subjects. And inside the sections also has little, um, little folders so I can put different pieces of work in there as well. And I thought this was really handy. It's just plain lined paper. And then something I actually got for my birthday from one of my best friends is this daily planner. But I put it in this section because it's like stationary. So this is just a daily planner that I can use to write down everything that I need to do because I'm not organized at all. But this and then the final thing I got, which I'm not really sure if I'll need these or not, but we got them anyways, are four binders. These came in a pack of four. Once again, they've got that blue color. So there's a purple, pink, blue, and gray. So I got these. I'm not sure if I will need these or not, but I got them in case since I am doing GCSE years this year. I'm going into year 10, if you're wondering. So that's all of the stationery that I got. It's basically all of the essentials, all of the necessities, and everything that needs for actual school. So next I'm going to go on to the essentials in boarding school. Next section that I'll be doing are toiletries. These are kind of like the essentials for boarding school. So first of all I got six packets of tissues because I have hay fever we just discovered and I have such a runny nose all the time. So these were an essential from what goes. Two packets of no strips. These are the tea tree with hazel from Boots very essential. Next I got a mini little jar of hairspray. This is mainly for competitions because I have such bad wispies if you can tell. So this is just to keep them back. And then I got a little mini shower gel. This is the British Rose one from the body shop. I thought that would just be nice to bring for every once in a while. And then I also got a body mist because I left my other one in Dubai stupidly. But I got the Satsuma one because I like the smell of Satsumas. So I got some Colgate toothpaste. This is the Max White if you're interested in what toothpaste I use. I just thought I should stock up on these sort of things so when I go I won't have to get them straight away. And then I got two Mitchum deodorants because these are an essential so I just got the Pure Fresh Mitchum ones. And then this is the fourth shampoo I've tried this year. If you can tell my hair is like super thick and curly and nothing works with my hair so we decided to try out the Aussie Mega Shampoo and Conditioner. Finally I got some razors. These are just a pack of blue razors. Very simple. 
quite essential. <laughs> I forgot about these, so I've got two different hand sanitizers. Obviously these are an essential at the moment. So this one is aloe vera and this one is just like a normal boring one. Now I'm on to just kind of random but useful things that you need for school and for boarding. So first of all I got two packets of hair bubbles. I got these really thick ones and I also got these stretchy ones. These are both from Primark. Primark have the cheapest and best have the cheapest and best hair bubbles so I stocked up on some of those and then since I'm now back in the UK I have to wear tights because I have a skirt so these are just three pairs of black tights from Primark and then also I got a pair of socks so I got black pairs and white pairs I prefer ankle socks over normal socks once again Primark Primark has all of the essentials these are like really weird but my sister got these for me and she said that they really helped her when she was at boarding school so these are like net washing bags that you put different things like your under eye in and then you put them in the washing machine basically just so I don't lose like certain things in the washing machine so rather than putting individual things in you put these in I don't know if that makes sense but these are called net washing bags if you're interested in getting yourself some <laughs> and then I got a extension lead this honestly I'm so happy I remembered it so you plug this into the wall if you've never seen one before and then it just has all of these plugs and you can turn off each one which I think is really great. And then I got an umbrella because I realised I don't have an umbrella and living in the UK it's kind of an essential. <laughs> this was £4 from Sports Direct I think. Some sporting items. First of all I got a new foam roller. This is a carry more one. If you guys are loyal subscribers of mine then you'll know that I have the exact same one in orange back home in Dubai. But I decided to get a black one. It was actually the only colour they had. I really really needed this because my back just felt like a brick and it was not a good good feeling so we got one of those and then we also bought this flexi band which is kind of cool since all of my equipment is back home I thought this was something that could really help me out with flexibility whilst I'm at school so I bought this next thing I got was a gum shield because I'm doing hockey for the first time ever so you need one of these otherwise your teeth will be knocked out I think this is red I don't really know but it was an essential, got that from Sports Direct and also from Sports Direct I got some shin pads once again for hockey. If I do football I don't think I will but in case Sports Direct also. And then something that I think is so handy to have is a portable charger. So I got one of these or power bank. I got this from Primark, it's just like a plain black. It will be good for when I'm at gym and stuff in case because my phone has the smallest battery life you will ever see. Some more essentials that I needed were some coat hangers. So we got two of these coat hangers from Primark. I don't think I need to explain these. For my room, I have some room decor. I'm not gonna show you all of the room decor that I have because I didn't buy it, my sister gave it to me. But if you watch my boarding school videos, which will be coming up in the next couple of weeks from when I filmed this, then you'll see the rest of my stuff. I'll show you that in a separate video. So first of all, I bought this really cute heart pillow. I thought it was really nice and fluffy and it'll look good on my bed. So I got this from Primark. It was a good bargain and I thought it's just so soft. And then my sister for my birthday got me some of these blue fairy lights. They're like two different color fairy lights. They're just string ones. So I'll be putting these up in my room. This one I didn't buy, but I thought it'd be good to put in the video. So I got this light box. My sister gave this to me when she had it in her room. So you can basically just put a message on it and then it lights up. So I thought that'd be nice to put in my room. I got some new slides, these Under Armour blue and white slides. I'm so excited about these because I wear my Nike ones literally everywhere, especially around the boarding house. I think those will be super handy dandy for me to have. And my sister got me some hot chocolate essentials. So she got me this mug with some hot chocolate in and then some mini marshmallows of course to put on the top. And then for my bedside table she got me a frame with a photo of her inside because that's the sort of sister I have. And I also got some new PJs for the boarding house to walk around in, to slumber around in. Just Good stuff. I also got this little um, set of three baskets, so I think I can take these out. I just thought they might be good to put scrunchies, hair bubbles, anything that comes to mind really. I also got some chalk. If you saw my Instagram, you'd have seen this. So I got eight blocks of chalk here. No gymnasts use chalk all of the time, so I needed a block of chalk. And along with that, I bought a plastic container to put the chalk in. So I have chalk at gym because I did not have it last time. The final thing I got was a pee bag. This is actually not a pee bag, it's a sketches bag, but I'm going 
to use it as a pee bag. I got some trainers because I didn't have any trainers. These are them, aren't they nice? I really like them. Okay, and the final thing I got is a Jack Wheels coat. And you guys will see all of this in another video so I'll close that so you get a little sneak peek of it. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I know I didn't go into too much detail about each product but there was so much to get through. It was quite stressful. <laughs> I hope that you guys enjoyed. Make sure you subscribe if you are wanting to see any boarding school videos because they will be coming up very very soon. I start on Wednesday, today is Sunday so not long to go now. <laughs> make sure you check out my Instagram, it will be in the description box down below. I post daily on there along with stories so if you want to stalk me then feel free to and I will see you guys in the next video.